We are here at the Under Letten in Zurich, the electricity power plant, which is powered by hydro, uh, by water power, basically. This is a specially good place, not only because it's producing renewable energy, it's also a nice place because you can swim in it and you can actually jump down from the bridge there. I've done that as a young boy. I always enjoyed it very much to play here in the river of the Limat. This is also, this is the place that we're shooting this video because I like to invest in NL, the Italian power plant, which is really focused on hydroelectric energy. But is NL a good company? Well, we know that the ranks are good. Otherwise, it wouldn't be on the Obermatt top 10 list of Italy from Obermatt. But I want to know more. I googled NL and I found what I always find. Some analysts say yes, buy it. Some analysts say no, sell it. And as usual, the analyst opinions don't really give you a clue. I leave this aside, I go to the website, and the website looks really nice. There's a message right on top that says exactly what I want to hear, revitalizing the desert, you know, meaning getting resources out of the desert. Now, everybody can say that, and I know marketing people are good at showing a company in the best light. So I go and dig deeper, and what I find is that they actually put their money where their word is. Most of the money that goes into new investments is invested in renewable energy. And that's exactly the company I want. want. I looked further and I found that already now a significant proportion of NL's electricity comes from renewable energies and from gas, which is also better than nuclear. There's only very a little nuclear energy in this company. A good reason to buy, I buy NL and I wish you good luck with your own decision.